going to be talking about waiting. What are some things you've had to wait for? Here are a couple that I thought of. In our Bible story today, the disciples had to wait too. So let's read it. Acts 1, 4. On one occasion while he was eating with them, he gave them this command. He is Jesus. Do not leave Jerusalem, but wait for the gift my father has promised, which you have heard me speak about. For John baptized with water, but in a few days you will be baptized with the Holy Spirit. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you, and you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Samaria and to the ends of the earth. Waiting is hard, but it's very important, and it was really important for the disciples. They needed to wait for the Holy Spirit, because the Holy Spirit would help them when they were sharing the gospel. The Holy Spirit will help us too, whenever we need it. All we have to do is ask. Let's continue reading in verse number 9. After he said this, he was taken up before their very eyes, and a cloud hid him from their sight. They were looking intently up into the sky as he was going, when suddenly two men dressed in white stood beside them. Men of Galilee, they said, why do you stand here looking into the sky? This same Jesus who has been taken from you into heaven will come back the same way you have seen him go. Jesus is coming back, and until then, it's our job to tell everybody about him, and the Holy Spirit will help us do that. Well, that's all the time I got for now. See you next time. Bye!